Tell New Tyra starts now. Now, every celebrity has their own diet secret, but just because it works for them doesn't mean that the diet is healthy or it's safe. So our next guest is going to tell us once and for all what the best way to lose weight is and which diet fads can endanger your life, because some of them really, really can. She's worked with Mandy Moore, Christina Aguilera, and Tori Spelling. Please welcome fitness and lifestyle consultant Ashley Borden. tour with Christina Aguilera, right? Yes, so I was on tour during her strip tour. Okay, and how do you guys work out on the road? Well, one of the things that we did a lot was boxing because it was portable cardio. You can get out the aggression. It was, we did mitts. We didn't have to have a big heavy bag. And it was an excellent way of burning calories okay. and getting a good workout in, no matter where we were. All right, so let's talk about portion control because I've gone to restaurants and you just oh. sit down and it's just like put out. Like there's yes. so much. You could feed like 10 people and I eat like half of it because it's on your plate. You think that you should. And, that, okay, and actually, that's a very, very good tip, because I tell people all the time, when you are going to go to a restaurant, one of the best things to do is to ask them, when you get your meal, ask them to divide it in half in the kitchen, so that way they can have it to go in a little doggy bag, you save some Even money, you save, some, yes, okay. you save some calories, and that way you're not going to overeat with everybody sitting there, and all of a sudden you realize you've eaten the entire and meal. And then you have leftovers the next day, which are so good. Exactly. Because like leftovers, I love leftovers. And I'm not ashamed to take a doggy bag. Yeah. I mean, there's, people get all weirded out about, who cares? So we've got some stuff here. What's going on well, here? Well, we're actually going to start here with the big... This is a horrendous example of a completely carbo-loaded plate because people would think, oh, you know, I have corn, I have some chicken. No, it's, it's awful. And it's also much. way too much. It's like a family of five. So how much is enough? Well, we actually, good that you would ask, we actually have this would be the normal size of a portion that you would have as opposed to something like this. That looks like the Tyra Tasty Tidbit it's, diet. Exactly, and I just saw your Tasty Tidbit. <laughs> yeah. That's an excellent... Because I always say to people, you want to do a food plan that's lean, livable lifestyle yeah so you know you can do portion control by yeah. using your fist for sizes so if you're going to have your carbohydrate size you want to do about a fist size of pasta okay you want to do your palm size of chicken or fish or turkey so if you're Shaquille O'Neal and have a big hand exactly he's a big guy so he can eat that he can much. do his hand Got it. we're so not eating his hand, hand. yes okay. exactly well thank you so much absolutely thank you so much and also my tasty tidbit thing I went back twice just to let you know to the buffet it wasn't just that one plate was that right. okay right I went yes. back twice with the little stuff but twice you know and I and I, you actually are, are, are hitting on something that's a really good point people when they feel deprivation they tend to binge. Yeah. So when you're following any food plan, that's why diet, I hate the word diet. diet. Because it's, I mean, the, A, the word die is in it. Okay. Yeah. And then also when you're doing a diet, you always end up flip-flopping and going off You of fall it. off and bang your head and bust your head wide open. That's what I say. And then I've you end up binging. off and bust my head wide open. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much. Oh, yes. Thank you. And now Absolutely. I know. We all know this much. Not this. Or you can bring your whole family and just split this up on different plates. <laughs> you all can right. eat this and go run three marathons afterwards. Well, we've got more from you. You're not yes, done yet. Absolutely. All right. She's going to tell us all about that stuff that's deadly that, you know, that you really need to stay away from when it comes to diets. We'll be right back. Lifestyle consultant Ashley Borden is here, and she's filling us in on the newest celebrity diet fads. She's going to tell us which ones are safe, which ones aren't, and how to tell the difference. So let's get started, because I know some of them are very un un unsafe. Scary. All Scary. right, so these lollipop things, what are these lollipops? Well, let's not be deceived by the lollipop. These are the new Hoodia lollipops. What, that is, what is Hoodia? Hoodia is a, it's very, in the same family as the ephedrine products that were banned, because by the way. Because of heart palpitations. Because of heart palpitations, people having... Uh, horrible side, side effects from it. Also, when you take anything like a lollipop, it ends up speeding up your metabolism, and then the minute you go off of them, you blow up. Really? So there is no short-term, you know, you, you take these and you think, oh, I'm going to be all lean, and the yeah. minute you start eating again, and you it curbs up. your appetite. You all don't right. want to curb your appetite. So this is bad. These are trash. 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 Nice. Okay. I know what this is. This is the whole master cleanse. I know a lot of people, and you know who you are, my friend, yes. that, um, <laughs> that they do this. It's cayenne pepper. Uh, maple uh, syrup. Uh, maple syrup, yes, thank you. Lemon and water. And the only people I really know who, who really need to do a cleanse is maybe if you've, you've been in surgery and you have tons of anesthetic in your body Got or something. It, to cleanse it out. Yeah, but other than this. that, you take this master cleanse and you think you're losing all this weight. You have no energy. You're a crab apple. And the you are a crab. You put, uh, something in the your minute mouth. you eat, you blow up again. So trash, trash it, trash it, get rid of it. Thank you. 
Thank you. This is for the homies. <laughs> okay. Okay. So this is the oil. This is Udo's oil. Okay. okay. Udo's oil is a blend oil. Now most people get terrified of oil. They think they're going to become fat beneath oil. Yeah. Oil is such an essential thing for a lean body, a a lean lifestyle, because it, it it helps to feed your muscle tissue, which gives you lean muscle. And what is this Udo? It's called Udo's U D O S oil. Okay. So you take two tablespoons a day. Udo it gives you oil. Great, Udo's oil. Okay, yep. Udo's and oil. you can take flaxseed oil too, but this is so a great this is mix. Good. So we this is good. We like ding, this. Ding ding ding. Yes, we like it. <laughs> Is your right. friend. Oil is your friend. Now, I've been hearing about these pills. There's yeah. some kind of pills. There that, should be that, flames coming that, out that, of these that, pills. That so, horses take. Yes. Something with horses with asthma. Yes. Take these pills. <laughs> And there's these people in Hollywood, actresses and stuff, and they take these pills. I hear they can kill yeah, you. Yeah, okay. First of all, the only people or, or, or animals that should be taking these, like you said, are horses, okay? That it's legal. These it's are illegal. It's a horse pill. Why is a yes. human taking a horse pill? I, because comuterol, which is what it's called, uh -huh. is an illegal, it's illegal for humans to take. Yeah. And it, 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 people think they take it and it rapidly changes your metabolism. So it speeds up your metabolism. You take it, you're a maniac, you're fried, you're on edge. The minute you go off of this as well, not only does it destroy your adrenal glands, mm -hmm. and it also ruins your metabolism. So, wow. in a much more permanent way. This can kill you. These Absolutely. pills, these weight loss pills, Clembuterol. can kill you. Absolutely. So, they are trash. 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 <laughs> all right. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Hope everybody was listening. How to stay healthy, but get in shape, all right? Okay, we'll be right back.